Uh, John Snyder, our weather watcher in South Denver, a half inch of precipitation. That is just beautiful to see. Uh, west side of town, you had lighter totals compared to the east. And uh, at this point, it looks like the bullseye there in Aurora, just over an inch, a little under an inch officially in Denver at the airport. We'll get some more totals through the afternoon, so those may change just a little bit. But overall, that's about where we are going to land. Northeastern Colorado, you can tell who is socked in the blue here. Uh, coldest from Denver out to the plains, a little more sunshine in the southeast, 50s and 60s there. Same thing out west. We have 50s and 60s on the western slope. Dakota McGee, our weather watcher out in Logan County. Look at this. He said he had about an inch of wet slushy snow fall uh, over the course of the morning and we still have just a few bands of snow out there on the far northeastern plains of Colorado from Julesburg down through Yuma Joe's uh, the Holyoke area and just outside of Burlington some light snow still hanging on just east of Denver a couple of pockets of flurries a few sprinkles and in the foothills we have a few flurries but the trend for the rest of your afternoon will be for drier air to work in and you can see that here on futurecast you could still see a little spit here and there, but overall we should see a little clearing trim as we move into your evening. Uh, statewide view shows the same thing by we get, time we get into tonight and early tomorrow. Most of the state should be partly cloudy to mostly clear, but it's short lived. Watch how fast clouds come right back into the picture here. We're going to have rain and snow developing by tomorrow afternoon in the mountains, and some of that is going to come back into the front range once again, which is some great news, and that will linger into your Wednesday morning. High temperatures today will warm a little bit more for uh, especially western and southern Colorado where you have more sunshine. As the clouds start to break here in the front range, we should warm a little bit, but the temperature not going up too much tonight as skies clear uh, will cool off, especially here on the eastern plains. So notice all the 20s showing up. That is a freeze, and in fact, southeastern Colorado, we have a freeze watch in effect. Want to just remind you, we still have drought conditions but the rain today helped uh, the more rain coming will help even more. There's that freeze watch late tonight into tomorrow for the southeastern corner of Colorado. So for today, topping off in the 40s, a few more snow showers and some clearing a uh, big warm up tomorrow 66, but that rain comes in late. Wednesday is unsettled again with some morning rain and the Michelle we do start a warming and drying trend Thursday into your weekend by Saturday. Somebody is going to hit those mid to upper 80s, which is pretty close to the record high. Wow. All right, Chris, thank you. And if you're already watching